Hello, hello. Welcome to Condition by Kia. Hope you're having a good week so far. So for today, I'm going to be doing a legs and back workout. I'm going to be using equipment wise with my door anchor with cables. I do have my bar for the door, but for those of you following along, you can also use handles. It does about the same. And out here, get those hips ready. Um, other than that, equipment wise, I am going to be using dumbbells and a mini band and a cable later on. Oh no, not the mini band, just the cable. So, right now, I am doing the warm up, getting my body ready. Getting the hips ready, getting the knees ready, and getting the heart rate up just a bit. I'm gonna do about 15 regular squats here. Get my legs ready for all the workout I'm about to get in. And about there. That's a pretty good warm up right there. So I'm going to start with my door cable here. And like I said, if you have just handles, handles will work perfectly fine as well. But if you are using a bar, I'm going to put my hands about midway. And from here, I'm going to do a squat row. So with either of the handles or your bar, feet are about shoulder width. And from here, it'll be squat down nice and low. Squeeze the back as you row. That's one. Squeeze the glutes right there down, squeeze your back, up and squeeze your glutes, two, three, five so far, about halfway. Thirteen, two more. Down and hold. One. Two, three, four, going for ten, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and twelve. Okay, next one. I'm gonna have my dumbbells. sides of my feet here. This will be like a static side lunge. Oh, you can see my feet. There we go. Yeah, this will be like a static side lunge into a row. So keeping your feet right where they are, it'll be coming down, row, up, over, and row. Making sure that you don't block out on the knees at any point. And squeezing the back nice and tight with the row. Five right there. Okay. 
है ना है Thirteen. so far. Sixteen. This is eighteen. And nineteen. And twenty right there. Move my dumbbell out of the way for my squat reps. Nice deep breath first. And back to that bar. Fifteen. And then a squat and hold for ten. Down. Squeeze. Squeeze the boots on the up one. Back squeeze. Boot squeeze, that's two. Back squeeze, boot squeeze, that's three. Five so far. Back squeeze, boot squeeze, six. Seven. Eight. Or halfway. Eleven, twelve, fourteen, fifteen, taking it down and row for ten. One, two. Next is those static side lunges. Bringing the feet out into that static side lunge. Got the dumbbells ready by my feet. And we have side lunge row, alternating for 20. Nice deep breath. And here we go. Over. That's one, two, three, and five so far. Making sure squeezing on the back muscles with every row. So far, there's 11, 12, 15, 15 so far, five more to go. Eighteen, four more back and forth, and this is twenty. Move my dumbbell out of the way here. And one more squat throw here. Holding the bar about midway. Nice deep breath and down. That's one. Two, squeeze the glutes. Back, glutes, that's three. 
back squeeze, glute squeeze, that's four. Five. Seven so far. That's eleven. Twelve. Thirteen, two more. That's fifteen down and hold and run for ten. Eight, nine, and right there. Got one more of those side lunges. Got one more of these static side lunges. Nice deep breath, court. Ready? Here we go. Five. One. Two. Three. Five so far. This is ten. That's about halfway. Nearly there. Thirteen. Fifteen. Seventeen. That one's eighteen. Two more. That one's nineteen. And twenty. <coughs> Moving the dumbbell over to the side. Now with the door anchor, I'm gonna swap out my weight here. So this cable that I have on the door right now is a hundred pound cable. Definitely my favorite one to use. But for this next exercise, I'm going to be using my 50 and my 30 of 80 pounds. Now this one you can always use regular handles as well, or you can use the bar. And this one I'm definitely using the bar because it's fun. But handles work just the same. And hands are going to be about midway. And it's going to be a trap pull down with an alternating back lunge. So pretty much your knees are going to be in this kind of stance the whole time. And it'll be Trap pull down with your back, back lunge, pull down, back lunge, that's two, three, four, 
five, six, eight so far. Eleven. Fifteen. Five more. Seventeen. Really be feeling along your spine so far. One here. All right, lots of goal. Goal flex back up. I'm grab my hands for these ones. Holding the dumbbells, palms together. Feet are going to be about shoulder width apart. Nice deep breath, of course. Like this. That's the start. Arms are like an L, palms are together. You're going to take it down into a squat. Flex your back. One, down, goal flex fly. Two, don't lock your knees. On the up, but squeeze your glutes. So glutes squeeze. Back. Seven so far. That's nine. Eleven. Two more. Cat pull downs, alternating back lunge again. Rest here. One more. And starting with those knees and hips in the hand. Pull. One. Back pull. Two. Three. Four. Five, nine so far, ten, Fifteen. Eighteen. Nineteen. And twenty. I'm oh, definitely just gonna hurry it up and go on. Good. Squat to full arm pack flex. This is the next one. Mm 
the feet are shoulder width. Palms are together. Elbows are like an L. Down. Full flex. Up and glute squeeze. Full flex. Glute squeeze. That's two. About eleven. Thirteen, two more. Fourteen. more of the trap pull down, alternating back lunge. One more deep breath here. Alright, come right to it. Alright, last one of these. Hips and knees, at a hinge. One, two, four, so four. One is 18, one more beach. 19. And one right there. Have one more. Squat to gold flex. I'll try to catch my breath here. Two more deep breaths, real quick. these ones. A shoulder width. Hands together like an L. Palms together. Knees unlocked and ready. Down and go flex. Down. Go flex. Up and glute squeeze. Go flex. Glute squeeze. And five more. Nearly there. That's 12. Fourteen. Fifteen there. Okay, so this next one. We need some wall space. Actually, 
Oh, my God, I'm trying to run away. I can do back flies with a bit of heavier weight, but as I'm going for a lot of reps, I'm going to go with fives for the moment, because I really want to focus more on the hamstring and glute with this exercise, with a lighter focus on back. Those first ones were heavier focus on the back, lighter focus on the legs, then I was the opposite. So basically, Start against the wall, left foot like a step, right foot like a little step. And I can't really see. Midway will probably be the best. Alright, but anyways, you want your front knee to be just slightly in front of the knee that's on the wall, or the foot that's on the wall. There should be about this much gap space between the knees. And you want to make sure your inner thighs don't punch together on this. So foot flat against the wall like that. You're going to go down into a deadlift. Back fly it and bring it back up. Ten for each leg. Down. Back fly. That's two. Three. Four. Five, six, a real little hamstring by now. Eight, nine, ten. Keep those knees on lock. Take a deep breath. And you swap sides. Now we got to even that out. Down. One. Down. Two. Three. Five so far. That's eight, nine, and ten. Well, that's those ones. Next thing will be lunge squat rows. So with your dumbbell, have your dumbbell, I should say. You're gonna get into your lunge squat position here. Take a deep breath first. Lean forward just slightly. Down. Throw it. Bring it up one. Down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Seven so far. And ten. To the other side. It's a balance there. But all is good. One more deep breath. Knees unlocked and ready. Forward lean, slightly. Down. One. Two. Three. Four. Eight so far. And 10. 
Let's let them fall down. And it's back to the wall. We got those single leg wall deadlift to back fly. Grab my lighter weights for this one. Remember, you want that slight difference between your knees there. The little straight leg, just slightly in front of the other one. Deep breath, and here we go. Down, back fly. One. Three so far. Eight, two more to go. And there. Nice deep breath. Foot on the wall. Down. And fly. That's one. Two. on the legs is definitely for real right there. Got those lundros. Nice deep breath. Grabbing that dumbbell. Puts in position. Forward lean and ready to go. Down. That's one. Down. And two. Three. Seven so far. And ten. Flopping feet. A nice deep breath. Forward lean. Down. Roll that one. Two. There's eight, two more. And ten. Set that for a moment. Got one more of these. One more big deep breath here. Maybe two. Okay, should be going crazy. Grabbing those dumbbells. Take a deep breath. Mentally prepare. Last one of these. Put up on the wall. And down. And fly it. Last one. Two.
six, so four, seven, eight, and ten. On the other side. Down. One. Down. Five. That's two. Three. Right there, two more. And right there. Lunge squat rows are next. And for each side. Hold my big deep breath here. Getting the dumbbell. Body into position. A nice deep breath. Knees are at the ready. Forward lean. Down. That's one. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, is nine, and ten. Top sides. Nice deep breath first. One more. Knees are at the ready. Forward lean. Last one of these. Down. Row, that's one. Two. Forty pound cable. I'm gonna give it some bunny ears. This is what I like to call bunny ears. Like this. Little circles in the front. Give that a quick little test. So test your cable real quick. Make sure you feel that back squeeze with your straight arms. So it'll be half yeah, raise back fly. Big deep breath here. Arms in front of you. Half raise. One. Half raise. Two. Three. Pick up your pace. Four. Five. Really feel those calves. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. right there. Oh no. That's the worst feeling right there. We have sweat right there on the eyelashes. Kind of a scary feeling. You don't want that sweat in your eyes. Ooh. Okay. So this one is going to be squat the back lunge. I'm ending my space here. 
So this one, as I was saying, mini band in the beginning, but for the back lunge, it doesn't quite work. So it goes out squat, back lunge, squat, back lunge, two. This one's kind of the fast one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then the other side, of course. Now it's what? Left side. One, two. These ones are going to go by quick. Three, four, five, six, eight. Calf raise, back flies next. This last superset should go by relatively quick. Okay, bunny ears. Deep breath. Let it test real quick. And ready? Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, eleven so far. Fifteen. This is 18, 19, 20. Got those squats coming up. Nice deep breath. Squat it, back lunge it. And I'm ready. Knees are unlocked and ready to go. Three, two, one, and go. One, one, two, three, four, And ten. And then the other side. Ready? Three, two, one. Up one. Two. Seven so far. And a little more. Reach one before quick stretch. Bunny okay. ears. Last one to these. Quick test. Down. Up. Back flex. One. Two. Four. Thirteen. 
13. Twenty there. Last one of those squats and back lunges. Roll with me, we're almost there. Last little push right here before the stretch. Nice deep breath. And then three, two, one, and go. Squat. Back lunge, that's one. Two. Three. Halfway. Eight. Now the other side. Nice deep breath. Then squat it. Then take it back. One. Two. Five. Halfway there. Six, seven, and ten. Now step and stretch. Let's go. Clean. for too long. If your heart rate's, if anything, it's like mine, quite up there. Our last bit's a bit cardio-ish. So you want your heart rate to calm down nice and slow. Bring one foot like a curtsy and lean. And deep breath. But like a curtsy and lean. Hey, good morning. It's going good. How about you? How's your morning so far? I'm quite literally just finishing up with the last bit of stretch. I did legs and back today, so it's a bit, a bit on the heavy. Heart rate's still going crazy, but slowing down nice and easy. Stretch the hamstring here. It has been an early morning. Well, over here anyways. Not sure what time it is for you, but on my time, I've been up since like 6.30. I totally misheard that. You said easy morning. <laughs> so yeah, it has been an easy morning. Are you doing your workout later today? Or are you doing your workout in a bit? Stretching that hamstring there. Now 
I got you. Yeah, 6.30 is pretty much my time all the time now, even if it's the weekend, because it's hot outside. So to go, I like to do like a run on the weekends. So if I don't go room before, if I'm not out the door before 7 and back before like 8.30, it's, it's brutally hot outside. And I don't like risking heat stroke, so. Ooh, pushing back on the hips right there. Do you wake up at 6.30 for work purposes or working out purposes? And back up, not to the other side. Hey, indoor treadmill. That must be nice. <laughs> I think it's been a long time since I've used a treadmill. But definitely a good benefit when it's hot outside. Do you prefer treadmill over running outside? Or would you prefer running outside? I got you. That's a good reason to wake up at 6.30, especially since you got little ones. They definitely take your time. These are going to be calf stretches. I'm putting my one foot on the dumbbell, pushing and stretching on the other foot. <laughs> you prefer not to run at all anyway. That's funny. <laughs> Oh man. Well, I was actually just about to call it right now. I've been streaming since 7.30. Got some clients to train in a bit, so I gotta prep for that. But anyone following along, thank you. Thank you so much for joining in and working out with me. Um, I'll be here tomorrow, 7.30, again, doing another workout. Um, if you wanna jump into any workouts later on, I do have all of these videos uploaded into YouTube with some music, of course. But thank you so much for joining in. Check out my website, conditionedbykia.com, if you want to see about any training. <laughs> you too. Stay buff. Keep working on that six pack. Hopefully, I see you tomorrow. <laughs> Have an awesome day, everyone.